Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. What's up, Virgos? Welcome back, y'all. I thank you so much for watching my channel. She's got the gift. Virgo, I'm back with an energy check-in for you, okay? Please take what resonates and leave the rest right on where it's at. If it do fit and it resonate with you and you're seeking a personal reading, you want me to do it, I'm more than happy to assist you on your healing journey. My website will be linked down below in the description box for all the newbies, okay? Also, if you guys want to show me more support, I would love it over there on Patreon or TikTok. One last thing before we jump into your message for the day, Virgos. I would like to give a huge shout out to this beautiful, amazing company that goes by the name Rose Forever. You guys, look at this. Yes, they showed up and sent me this box just in time for the holidays. Y'all know Thanksgiving is coming up. I'm going to put this right in the middle, okay, of our feast and allow everybody to look at them and smell them and feel the joy that i've been feeling you guys this beautiful rose company that goes by the name rose forever has amazing sales going on and deals baby also you can get it different colors okay different flavors switch it up a little bit y'all see the red ones back there but this is just two of many because i have many boxes of these like i was saying you guys if it's your first time dealing with them go ahead and check them out this is, these roses are 100 real 100 vegan and they last you all year around you can't beat that okay how lovely go ahead you guys and take advantage of all the sales and discounts they got going on especially if it's your first time dealing with them they gonna hook you up okay also i will leave a discount code down below in the description box for this company so let's jump into your messages virgo energy spirit angels i welcome you in at this time Thank you for using me as a vessel to channel for you. I'm grateful. Protect us, angels. Protect our foundation and our loved ones. Allow no weapon that's being formed to come against us to prosper. All oh, black magic, evil entities, spell work being sent our way, negative spirits, monitoring energies are to be blocked and returned to sender immediately. Messages for Virgo. August 9th could be significant. September 9th uh, as well. Something about the number nine here is coming out, Virgo, a lot. You got the nine of cups here showing up. You got the magician. Mm, you got the eight of wands here showing up. And then you also have the knight of swords. Some sort of information here, a text message, get somebody heated. Ready to go in and for ready for war here, baby. At the bottom of the deck, you got the sun. Yeah, Virgo is giving the energy of something here coming to light. About somebody being a player taking advantage of their family or taking advantage of their spouse. Yeah, it's like somebody here doing some iffy shit to you, Virgo. Are you doing some iffy shit to your spouse? But I feel like it's all about to come out. Or it already has came out. Yeah, somebody here is very selfish, overindulging in everything here. Inside on this Knight of Cups. Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups, Spirit Angels for Virgos. Or a pentacle, yeah, who, Virgo, you dealing with a selfish, toxic, you could be dealing with a Capricorn, you could be dealing with another Virgo. Four of pentacles here, devil, the chariot, mm, moving too fast, ooh, wee, somebody here need to slow down, somebody needs to slow down. Virgo, they trying to put you up on game about this person that you're dealing with here. They real toxic. They selfish. They don't take accountability. They don't look out for nobody but themselves. Or this could be another Virgo you're dealing with. Or you don't give a fuck about nobody but yourself. Ooh -wee. Give me one more. Three of Wands. Yeah, they're planning something, though. Are you planning something? Inside on this magician. You just did. I feel like somebody dealing with a trickster here. Somebody know how to get you. They, but whoever this is, you bound to them in some sort of way here with the devil. This is something that y'all do with each other on and off. Or, uh, I don't like energy like this. Scatter. Queen of Pentacles here. Feminine energy. This could be you. This could be a Taurus you're dealing with. So somebody here is like currently manifesting here. Uh, re reconnection. Yeah, you got the Queen of Pentacles, Three of Cups here, Page of Wands, Two of Swords. Yeah. Somebody heart chakra is closed. Like somebody like don't open up because they still in love with somebody that they want to rekindle with. Two of Cups. Leo energy to me. Another Taurus. I mean the Taurus, another Virgo is here. Capricorn energy is here. Cancer too. Show me more about these messages that's coming in for Virgo. Inside on the Eight of Wands. The Fool. The 
page of cups. Mm. Somebody here could be getting news that they're pregnant or calling you and saying that they're pregnant by you, Virgo. Mm. Heavy on a Leo. Somebody here could be an Aquarius. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. Aries energy is here too. Give me one more on this. Six of Wands. Mm. Show me one more. There's a new beginning here for somebody. You meet someone new, or you start dealing with somebody new. Knight of Pentacles, yeah, you go, you come in with an offer towards somebody new, or somebody comes in with an offer towards you. You could work with this person. Somebody is lying here about a third party. Like, some, whoever this selfish person is, I feel like you'll never get the whole them Virgo because they're dealing with somebody else in the cut, right? Um, this person is manipulating you. They trying to tell you here that they're not, but they are. Uh, somebody could have recently ghosted you or, like, recently went silent on you. This is why, because they're dealing with somebody else. I see messages coming in. This could be from somebody new with this page of cups here, Knight of Pentacles. Slowly but surely, you will get something new here, Ace of Pentacles. So there's a new offer here on the table. Insight on this Knight of Swords. Why is this here for Virgo? Mm. Yeah, Virgo, you attached to a very toxic person here who's selfish, self-centered. They plan to, they plan to hear, they plan to come in and, um, manipulate you here with this magician showing up three of cups somebody playing like this is their plan to manipulate you a lying about the give me one more on this three of cups it's like they're manipulating you they're lying about a third party one more on the three one on the three of cups one more on the three of cups one on the three of cups, three on this. Six of uh, swords. This person travels to see whoever this third party is. Mm. This the other person could be somebody right up under your nose, Virgo. You could work with this person or this person work with this, with this third party. You dealing with a Capricorn, go watch the Capricorn read. Five of Wands, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Three of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck again. Yeah. Somebody started. Mm -hmm. Somebody started dealing with somebody at work. Give me one on this Ace of Pentacles. Who is this new person? Knight of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles energy. Who is this? Who Virgo? Knight of Wands. It could be a fire sign. Sagittarius in particular. Seven of Wands here, Nine of Cups. Damn. There's a blockage here, though. Or right, the reason why this connection ain't took off with whoever this new person is is because you still got this toxic person in your energy blocking it. Show me more on the Knight of Swords. This explains the Knight of Swords energy. Somebody here is toxic. You being lied to. They manipulating you about over this third party. They doing shit. Um, six of six of cups. The past person comes rushing back in. It's a blockage. Seven. Something backfire. It's a blockage. Whoever this person left you for and went towards, things didn't work out that way, Virgo. And now they bringing a raggedy ass back. One more. water sign is in their feelings over this because you leaving them or something to do with this water sign being sad um what's the outcome of this for virgo virgo it's, it seems like um the same energy is in your energy okay the same person that i've been picking up on for the last couple of readings here about you and this person has been manipulating you or not they the person don't want you but they don't want nobody else to have you 
um, the hierophant here is showing up in reverse position. It's your outcome. It's going to be a Taurus you have to drop or leave alone. A water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio is in their feelings over this. Um, Pisces in particular. King of Cups here. Cancer out here strong. Chariot, King of Cups. Uh, three of Pentacles again at the bottom of the deck. Wow. Advice for Virgos dealing with this situation. Um, I see somebody here, the outcome with the Hierophant here being in reverse position and the King of Cups here upright. I, I see somebody here deciding to um, listen to their emotions and be guided with the Hierophant in reverse position and to drop a contract with this toxic person, okay? Advice for Virgos. Yeah, I see a contract being dropped here. Because somebody is lying, they don't always lie. They don't want you, but they don't want nobody else to have you. This person is manipulating you about this third party. I don't know if they told you here that, you know, they was going to leave the person alone, but they not. Um, your advice is the Eight of Wands here with the Ace of Wands. 88 is significant. 99 is significant as well. Um, but your advice is to go towards something new. Don't walk, run, okay? I'm leaving it there. I love you, Virgos. This, I hope this helped you, babe. I hope you got some type of clarity. If you did, please don't forget to hit the like, the comment, and subscribe button. Until next time, peace.